What is up? Welcome to today's video. If you guys don't know me, hi, my name is Rosa and I'm just your average Disney loving spooky girl next door. And today we are here with part two of my January haul. Part one was like 30 minutes uh, pre-editing, so I have no idea how long it is now. But I decided since it was 30 minutes long, we're going to do part two right now, which isn't like that much clothing, but it's going to be a lot shorter. So go ahead and get started. If you guys like this video, get a huge thumbs up. It's Brad. Oh wow, can I not talk today? If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't yet joined the Bright Patch fan, but we have fun here all the time. Let's go ahead and get started. This is the second bag. I went to Goodwill to like only fill up one bag. I wasn't trying to like go crazed, but let me tell you, I went crazed. Um, by accident, by accident. It wasn't supposed to happen. So I'm gonna show you the first thing I got, girl. I don't usually pick these kind of things up because they take up way too much in my storage, but I thought, Let's try it. This is White House Black Market size 12 like jacket cardigan. It has like a little bit of a shoulder pad, but not too much. I just thought it was really, really cute. It has like that little like um, champagne sparkle to it, which I thought was really pretty. The sleeves I thought were really nice. This one was also on sale. It was originally $9, but I got for $4.50, so it didn't feel that terrible getting it. It also does have a little bit of a shoulder pad whoops but it's okay it'll probably sell more on ebay than it will on poshmark so that's not a big deal by the way if you guys are new to my channel i sell on ebay and poshmark sorry i just filmed the first one and i forgot to completely tell you guys i sell on ebay and poshmark i am a part-time reseller hoping to be a full-time reseller one day so you're gonna see a lot of thrift hauls on this video on this video on this channel girls so if you guys like thrift hauls make sure to subscribe to this channel because i do a lot of them and i also have like disney videos on here and like personal videos on here and we go nuts so let's just keep on going next in this bag i got fresh produce okay i only picked this up because i saw this on someone's instagram and they were like showing a tag of what they found so usually when people show tags of what they found they're kind of like happy with what they're found so i picked this up thinking that it's money so if i'm wrong let me know but fresh produce i have no idea what this brand is but i found it and i saw it on someone's thingy so i got it and it was half off of five dollars so it was to fit it so the next thing i got was this really 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 cute yellow top actually okay this is my favorite brand to sell because i just think their designs are so pretty they always make cardigans this is angel of the north this is a um anthropology brand they carried on anthropology it is just a really nice cable knit slash thin knit cardigan and it's yellow it's really pretty it's like this gorgeous like golden yellow it's not like that ugly yellow it's like gorgeous golden yellow like orangey yellow and if you guys are wondering what that is it looks like this is what it looks like angel of the north this is a size small it's just really nice i got it for seven dollars but easily i always say 25 to 35 just to keep myself on the low end because if i sell it for more i will probably be so happy um next this is another angel of the north got it because it was angel of the north is this angel of the north no it's moth my bad moth is also an anthropology brand i also like the way like moth and one september and angel of the north are like my favorites because i just love the way that they use patterns and different textures and stuff so this is a really nice warm kind of cardigan yeah it is a car it's a button down cardigan or button up cardigan so because it doesn't button up all the way long sleeve it's like chevron tribal print it's very like boho -y, hip not hippie but like well i guess i mean i don't know i like it i would wear this this is a size medium what is this this is olive and oak so i'm i think olive and oak is supposed to be a stitch fix brand i'm not sure um i think i heard the queen of thrift talk about it but like i'm not 100 percent sure but i bought it anyways because it was extra large so what did it look like olive and oak and if it sells well i'll pick up more because like let me tell you mine always has olive and oak like my goodwill always carries this so it's just like a sheer um like sweater and it was six dollars got it for three bucks because it was on half off Guess what else I got? I think this is oh my god, this one smells good. Someone probably just washed this when they donated it. Um, it's huge, it's amazing. Where the heck is the thing? Here it is. Angel of the North. Gorgeous, beautiful, medium knit, open knit, 
white ivory cream colored cardigan this is a size medium beautiful I love the waterfront waterfall front detail I got it for nine dollars you guys but I'm hoping I can sell this for 35 to 45 dollars that would be amazing it is just beautiful condition and it's so pretty next we got ourselves another athleta top oh I don't know this is the first athleta of this video I don't know but this is an athleta top I got a lot of athleta tops if you guys want to see what other athleta tops I got watch my previous video my previous thrift um it's just a very very long tunic top perfect to wear for legging with leggings it's very very soft I'd probably wear this myself I might even keep it I don't know sometimes I keep stuff for myself but I know that I need to sell it because I need to make money for this wedding you guys Ugh. but this was originally $8.99 but I got it for uh half off so it was $4.50 let's see what else we got in here okay I found my bread and butter baby Bread and butter, torrid top size two. Oh, I love it. It is, oh, I didn't even realize. It has like that little flap opening thing, but it still is like, I don't know. It is super nice. It has like that crisscross flap opening, but it's still covered. Like there's this part and then there's like an overlay with this. So it's not like completely open. Oh, and I love the sleeves. It's so pretty, you guys. And it's just floral. It's just like torrid. I love you, torrid. Got this for half off $8.99. So I got it for $4.50. I'm hoping to sell it for about $18 to $25. That's kind of how much torrid sells for me. Maybe I'll get a little more for this. Maybe I'll get $30 from that. That would be great. All right, and this is the last thing in the bag. And I got this from Roots. It is super dirty, so I have to actually wash it because I think it was just drug around too long. And nobody saw it, and I saw it, and I was like, I'm going to wash this so well before I put it up to sell it. But it's a little dusty, so excuse it. But it is this. If you guys watch Rally Roots, you would know that they just found something like this, like a couple of videos ago. Maybe like 10 videos ago. I don't know. I saw their video a couple weeks ago, and they talked about this brand. This brand is called, you can't read it, but it is called... Oh my god, I don't even know. Stacy? Stussy? Stasi? I have to look it up because to be completely honest, it's an extra small though, but it's cool. Um, I can't even like read what it is. But this is the this is what it looks like. And it was so funny because it totally like ca caught me off guard when they were they're like you're not gonna be able to read the tag but this is you need to pick this up even though you can't read the tag and I was like and then I was looking at this and I was like I can't read this tag <gasps> oh my god so that is what the tag looks like if you guys are wondering so with the sorry about my nails my nails are really crappy right now um my bad but this is the tag and it is a size extra small and I think it's really cute it's like they said that it's an equivalent to obey I don't know six dollars I mean I'd wear it if I was that cool but like it was six dollars so and I paid full price for it so that was everything in this part two video oh I hope you guys enjoyed it give this video a huge thumbs up if you liked it subscribe if you haven't interested in the bright patch fan and we have fun here all the time and I will see you guys all in the next video Bye bye yo what's up I'm the mad hitter I'll pour you tea please don't let it spread out it really matter Cause I'm the mad head <laughs>